Hello! Today we are going to talk about how to find the readability score for any document that you're creating in Word. So why is this important? Well, Word is used by people all over the world for a wide variety of applications. So a teacher, for instance, would want to make sure that a handout is written at the appropriate level for the students that it is being distributed to. In addition, if you deal with international clients or customers, you may want to make sure that documents distributed to them are written at a level that is consistent with their English language skills. Getting a readability score in Word doesn't even require additional software, although you certainly can run your text through any number of online tools designed to gather this type of information as well. Today, though, we'll show you how to check your score via the Flesh Reading Ease Test right from within Word. First, click on the File menu and choose Options. Then, navigate to the Proofing tab. Under the When Correcting Spelling and Grammar in Word heading, you'll see a box that says Show Readability Statistics. You want to check this box. Then exit out of your options and back to your document. Now, run a standard spelling and grammar check just like you would any other time. You will then be able to see scores based on two tests. The first is the Flesh Reading Ease test that I mentioned earlier, and the second is the Flesh Kincaid Grade Level Score. The higher the score on the Reading Ease test, the easier the document is thought to be to read. If your document is at least 60, it should be relatively easy to read although you can aim for higher scores if increased readability is important to you. The grade level is equivalent to the reading level of students. An 8, for example, would mean that the material is appropriate for an 8th grader. If you hit somewhere between 7 and 8, it should be very readable for the majority of people. Hopefully you found this helpful. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day!